Good morning, South Florida. I'm Eric Yutze. Here's a look at your top stories on this Monday. Chaos at the gates as they open at Hard Rock Stadium in Miami Gardens before the Copa America final. Soccer fans stood in line for hours waiting for the doors to open on Sunday, but the waiting reached a boiling point when people pushed past security and ticket takers. Cell phone video shows officers forcing the crowd back, trying to catch those breaching security. At one point, police had to tackle some fans. The game delayed for more than an hour because of the chaos. Argentina eventually winning the final against Colombia 1-0. The FBI has identified the gunman responsible for the assassination attempt on former President Donald Trump in a Pennsylvania rally. The FBI says 20-year-old Matthew Crooks killed one bystander and injured two others, including injuring the former President Trump before being killed by Secret Service agents on Saturday. The FBI said Crooks had no history of mental illness. President Biden addressing the nation in a message from the Oval Office on Sunday, saying there is no place for political violence in our country. Overwhelming support pouring in for the former president across South Florida. Supporters lining the streets of Trump National Doral and the president's Mar-a-Lago estate after the attempted assassination Saturday night. Many of them condemning the actions of the gunmen, stating there should be no violence against any party. End boat accident that happened at the Hullover Marina is now under investigation. The Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission said a personal watercraft crashed into a boat Sunday morning, leaving one passenger injured. FWC officers at the scene Sunday afternoon examining a boat there. EMT crews were also at the scene. We have reached out to FWC for more information and are waiting to hear back. As breaking news happens, we can be covered on air and online. Head to local10.com for more local news coverage and updates.